In today's video, we will get to know some of the world's most dangerous insects to ever exist. We'll be seeing a fly whose larvae are nightmare fuel, a cute yet deadly caterpillar, and an insect so common that you see it in everyday life but has caused more deaths than the rest. But before that, let's get to know a common pest that you can find on your furry companions. Number 10. Ticks If you have any pets, then you surely have seen this tiny insect. And if you don't, then you probably still have seen these blood-sucking pests. Ticks are so common that you can find them anywhere in the world. They usually target animals, but there are the occasional times that they go for humans. And when they do target people, it wouldn't be as bad as this. Does it make your skin cruel? Well, worry not, because those are just a type of seed being glued onto the poor boy's neck, making it look like a tick infestation. Videos like this have been appearing on the internet quite a lot, mainly for the views, which is quite sad if you think about it. Videos like these downplay the actual danger of ticks to humans. Tick-borne diseases can cause several symptoms, and they typically develop just within several days to a week after the bite. Some of these symptoms include a red spot or rash near the bite, fever, chills, nausea, headaches, muscle or joint pain, and swollen lymph nodes. If left untreated, said symptoms could worsen and develop into more serious problems, such as Lyme disease, tularemia, and ehrlichiosis. Number 9. Tsetse fly Native to tropical Africa, the tsetse fly, or also known as the tick tick fly, are about the same size as a large housefly, ranging from 8 to 17 millimeters. They are generally found in damp areas along riverbanks and lakes. As harmless as they look, these pesky little pests feed on only one thing. Blood. That's right folks, you heard that right, they feed on blood and nothing but blood. They generally target antelope, cattle, horses, pigs, and even humans. Tsetse flies are carriers of a dangerous disease called trypanosomiasis, or commonly known as the African sleeping sickness. Symptoms of this disease include fatigue, headaches, muscle aches, and a high fever. If bitten by one, better make sure to get that treated immediately, or else it would affect your central nervous system, which would then lead to disorders such as sleep and psychiatric related, seizures, a coma, or even worse, death. Fortunately though, the chances of getting ill from a tsetse bite are tiny, and the chances of an infection are even tinier at less than 0.1%. If you do ever visit the tsetse fly's habitat, be sure to avoid wearing blue, black, or any bright-colored clothing as these flies are attracted to those. And of course, don't forget your insect repellent. Number 8. Fire Ants I'm pretty sure that at some point in their lives, people have been bitten by ants at least once. Regular ant bites do sting quite a bit, but have you ever been bitten by a fire ant? True to their name, their sting inflicts a burning pain on people. These ants have also caused the deaths of people, albeit rare, more than 80 deaths have been recorded. These pesky little pests can be found in a lot of places, and they can get very annoying once they build their mound, which is usually about a foot high. These ants are very aggressive when disturbed, and when provoked, not only do they attack by swarms, but they are also very difficult to remove once they start singing as they tend to anchor themselves by biting onto the skin. So, if you ever see a fire ant mound near your house, better call that exterminator real quick, or you're going to have a problem soon. Number 7. Murder Hornets Native to temperate and tropical East Asia, South Asia, mainland Southeast Asia, and parts of the Russian Far East, the Asian giant hornet is the world's largest hornet, ranging from a size of 1.5 to slightly over 2 inches long. These bugs have earned the nickname of murder hornets for their ability to wreak havoc on other bees and hornet species and easily wipe out their hives. Their stings contain a venom so potent that it could kill a human with an allergy, and with enough of it, could kill a human without one. It is said that the Asian giant hornets cause around 30 to 50 deaths a year in Japan. Number 6. Kissing Bug The triatamine bug, or commonly known as the kissing bug, has earned its rather romantic nickname from how it tends to bite people, most especially sleeping ones, on the face, most especially around the mouth or eyes. However, this insect is anything but romantic. Commonly found through North, Central, and South America, the kissing bug sucks blood and can spread a parasite called Trypanosoma cruzi, which causes Chagas disease. 
The kissing bug leaves a bite wound near the mouth, and unfortunately for whoever is bitten, this bug loves to defecate on the source of its meal. Talk about gross! These excrements can enter the wound if scratched or rubbed, and if the bug is infected by the parasite above, then you might get infected with Chagas disease. Number 5. Human Botfly Have you ever heard of those horrific stories of people infested with maggots before? If you haven't, then hold on tight as we talk about one of the causes of those. If you're squeamish and have a weak stomach, then now would be a good time to look away. The Dermatobia hominis, or more commonly known as the human botfly, is a species of botfly whose larvae specifically grows in humans. Primarily found in Central and South America, these parasitic insects grow within a person's skin. Some botflies latch onto mosquitoes mid-flight and attach their eggs to the mosquito's stomachs. Then, when these mosquitoes feed on humans, the eggs burrow into the tiny wound left by the mosquito bite. That's where the terrifying stories start. These eggs eventually turn into larvae, and they will start to dig their way out from underneath the person's skin. This leads to painful wounds filled with pus. Although not deadly, those affected should get treated as soon as possible to avoid worsening of the infection. Removing the larvae is as gross as you would imagine it to be, and rather painful too, as they have tiny barbed spines that anchor them in place. Number 4. Assassin Caterpillar Tiny in nature, and with cute little green spikes protruding from its body, this caterpillar is one bug that you would not want to mess with. Responsible for more than 600 cases of caterpillar poisoning and several human deaths, this cute fella has rightfully earned its nickname, Assassin Caterpillar. Found in the rainforests of southern Brazil, this bug is said to be the world's deadliest and most venomous caterpillar to ever exist. Their tiny spike-like bristles contain a powerful anticoagulant venom, which even a slight brush against one can cause vomiting, internal bleeding, and rupturing of the red blood cells. Touch more than that, you could have a really bad case of internal hemorrhaging, kidney failure, or even death. Number 3. Killer Bee Created in a laboratory in Brazil, the Africanized bee is a mix of a European honeybee and an African bee. Scientists have wanted to create a bee that would be more efficient and produce more honey, but unfortunately for them, instead of the improved version of a honeybee, they had created a less effective yet highly aggressive species. This new group of hybrid bees managed to escape the confines of their birthplace and began spreading throughout Brazil and into the United States. The Africanized bee has earned its title of killer bee, as they have caused more than thousands of deaths worldwide. Although their venom isn't stronger than that of the others, killer bees attack in swarms, delivering hundreds and even thousands of stings, which is the estimated amount needed to kill an adult human. They're also pretty well known for their aggressive temper, and they will chase you for more than a quarter of a mile once aggravated. Now that would be quite a sight to see. Killer bees could easily be mistaken as their relative, the European honeybee. The only difference? Killer bees tend to be smaller in nature, so unless you want to risk the wrath of a swarm of deadly bees by going ahead and measuring them, then you might as well leave the identifying to the experts. Number 2. Pus Caterpillar Just one look at this fluffy and fuzzy little caterpillar is enough to make you go ah. From a safe distance, the southern flannel moth's larva, or commonly known as the pus caterpillar, looks so soft that you would want to pet it. However, you should probably keep your hands to yourself, as this cute little fella is one of the world's most toxic caterpillars, just right up there along with the assassin caterpillar. It may have long silky hair resembling cotton or even fur, but once that makes contact with your skin, it can cause intense throbbing pain, rashes, and even burning. Some people may even experience worse symptoms, such as headaches, fever, nausea, vomiting, rapid heartbeat, and seizures. The stings from its hairs can be so painful that a number of people have been sent to the ER because of it. Goes to show that you really shouldn't be fooled by appearances. Number 1. Mosquitoes Found almost everywhere in the world, mosquitoes are the most common and most annoying insects to ever exist. They are also perhaps one of the most dangerous insects in the world, as they are carriers of tons of harmful diseases. Sounds unbelievable if you think about it, right? But in fact, according to the World Health Organization, mosquitoes are responsible for more than a million deaths per year, the majority of which are due to malaria. The World Health Organization estimates that between 300 and 500 million cases of malaria occur each year. 
However, it's not the mosquito itself that causes these deaths, but instead a parasite carried by them. And not all mosquitoes carry this malaria parasite, but only the female ones from the Anopheles genus. These female mosquitoes transmit the disease from one infected person to a healthy one. Aside from malaria, mosquitoes also transmit other deadly diseases, such as dengue fever, which infects up to 100 million a year, the West Nile virus, and the Zika virus. Who would have thought that such a common insect would be such a powerful force? Well, just be sure to stock up on insect repellent and make sure that there are no possible mosquito breeding areas near you and you'll be safe. Probably.